Good morning, everyone. Today I am here in Auckland, New Zealand, and I'm currently leaving my flat to go and get some breakfast, hopefully. Got a little mint and cheese pie from Tart Bakery, and promise you it's not actual mints. Uh, the whole bakery is vegan. Let's try it out. Do I love it? No. It just like looks like fucking sloppy joe. I don't know why pies are so big here. They're not really a thing in the US, but like everywhere you go, like a big breakfast staple is like pies. I'm gonna eat my donut. The mince pie, not not good at all. I did not like that. Uh, it was disgusting actually. I'm really glad that my New Zealand working holiday visa guide helped you guys. Well, I gotta, oh my God. Did you see that? <laughs> just eat and then I ended up shopping and spending like almost $400. After shopping though I did make sure to go and study at the library for a little bit so that was like my payment I guess. Like I was like as long as I study today then I feel like shopping. I like I'm justifying my shopping by being like oh it's a reward for studying. So yeah now that I'm back home I'm done studying for the day. I'm gonna probably change, get dinner, and then head over to Brayden's house. Alright guys let's go see a movie. So who's your deal? I'm just starting on that one. <laughs> the world is your oyster. The world is your oyster? Yeah. In an American accent? Yeah. You want to say it in an American accent? Yeah. Supposedly it's the hardest thing to say like a sentence wise. The world is your oyster. Fuck, that is <laughs> oyster is the part that's fucking me. And then it's fucking me for the world part because it's like I'm thinking about the word oyster. Good morning, it's the 12th of October currently. I work 11 hours today, so I really won't be vlogging. I think I just twist. Where do I want the spirals? What I have to decide. Pajoya. Pajoya. Where is it? Pajoya. Good morning, everyone. Today is a beautiful day out. It is currently not 8 a.m. 8 a.m. I almost said 9. It's 8 a.m. And I'm walking to my local coffee shop. It's like a 10 minute walk. It's really not far at all. It's gonna be a great start to the day. I have all my books. I'm off today. I spent the night at Brayden's last night. This is the fit today. I feel like I'm going to school. Ooh. <laughs> Japanese tattoo guys I've been wanting a Japanese tattoo for years it says Genkai Okoiro it's what Yami says all the time in Black Clover if you guys know or watch the anime Black Clover Yami is by far like the best anime character ever um, and I just love the phrase so it means surpass your limit and this is basically just reminding me to always try my best and then this little guy right here he is a doodle that my mom always did for me growing up he kind of reminds me of like a puffle from Club Penguin. Genuinely, I don't know where he's from or where my mom got him. She does not know I have this tattoo. She texted me last week very jokingly and said, you have so many fucking tattoos, you should just get this tattooed. A week later, he is now on my hand. I'm about to call my mom. It's her birthday today and she's gonna see my tattoo for the first time. Hi, Maddie. Hello. Hi, Maddie. And I also wanted to show you that I did get it. So. Oh Lord, have mercy on your hands. What is it? <laughs> it's a little guy. She draws all the time. Oh, just a little guy. That's yeah. A little monster. They're like girls. Girls. Oh, 
Oh, Zoe's mad at you. Why is she? Why is she mad? Yeah, why are you mad? Oh, she hates that monster, Maddie. Is it scary or what? Because I always have to draw it, Maddie. She hates it. I said, why would you actually get it? It's supposed to be a joke. I know, I knew it was a joke, but, like, you texted me, and I think that, like, a couple days later, I was like, yeah, I'll just go in and get it. I did a walk-in. My birthday present, I like it. That's, a, that's part of your birthday present, yeah. All right, bye, hon. Bye, love you, happy birthday. Love you, Sadie. Thank you. fast the time goes. It's one of my favorite cities by far. I've only had good experiences here in Auckland. I would highly recommend spending at least a month or two um, here just to get to know the area and get to know the people. I'm so excited to see what the rest of New Zealand brings. Um, here's some more adventures.